guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm here with my mom, who you all know, hopefully, <laughs> from my other video. And today we're going to be trying some Oriental Asian snacks. Um, mm. We have a market by our house, so we went there earlier this morning, and we got a bunch of random, interesting looking things, and we're gonna try it today. I've been wanting to do this for a long time, but we just haven't gone, yep, right? Yep. <laughs> we could have, but we haven't. This so, is exciting. <laughs> what do you want to start off with? Whatever you, you, I'll let you pick. Okay, so oh God. <laughs> the first thing we are going to try is tamarind candy, and it's spicy. And what's tamarind? Oh gosh, oh this is awful. I, I think tamarind is a fruit maybe? Is it? Well, I think so. Okay. Or is it a vegetable? I don't, I don't know. know. Oh god. So basically what this is, it is tamarind, sugar, salt, and chili powder. We decided to get the hot kind because we do like spice. Definitely. So, we're gonna try it. You wanna try it at the same time? Okay. A little nervous. Okay. See what it looks like? It's a very interesting smell. It looks like it has sugar all on it's the like outside. It's like a sugar coated it. turd. Oh, look, yours is a lot smaller than mine. <laughs> you have to pop the whole thing in your mouth. Okay. I'm nervous. What if it tastes bad? Well, wait, do you want the yeah, paper towel? Yeah, let's get the paper towels. We do have paper towels just in case. Okay. We have an issue. <laughs> Thank you. Thanks. All right, ready? Yep. Why is it hard? Are we chewing it? What are you doing? Ew, I don't like this. What's the thing that's hard in the middle? Is that, is that a pit? <laughs> Ew, what is this? I don't like this. What is it? I'm eating it. It's really not that bad. It's spicy. That's a pit. It, it has like a soury flavor. I had no idea there was a pit in it. I didn't know either. Wow, it's spicy. It is spicy. I like that about it, but mm -hmm. it just weirded me out because I don't think I was like expecting something like that. What's I was that? expecting something like gooier, mm -hmm. and it's a lot softer. If that makes any sense. Yeah, I thought it was going to be like a yeah. gooey kind of thing too. Yeah. The spite, if you like hot, though, yeah, it's that nice. is good. It's got a nice little mm -hmm. kick to it. They do have a regular one too, but well. Do I get one point? Do you yeah, get sure. Let's get points because for I finishing actually, it. I actually ate the whole thing. Yeah, that's except good. for the pit. <laughs> okay, the next thing we got was green tea candy. It's not focusing. Oh, you know. Oh, there we go. Okay, so um, we both love green tea, and I guess this is like a hard candy. Mmm, it smells like green tea. Does it? Can I smell? <laughs> Doesn't it kind of a little bit? Yeah, it does. Okay, it actually it comes does in these have little. A little um, Cute. cute packs, yeah, Very cute. really cute. All right, I hope I can get this. I my mouth is so like fiery right really? now. Really? Well, not fiery, but it's a little. No, spicy. mine wasn't that bad, but I guess I didn't have but my you mouth didn't long eat, enough. You didn't eat the whole thing, and mine was bigger than you. Yeah. Oh, it even has like a them. little. Um, you're not gonna be able to see. No. Okay. Well, you can't really see up close. My camera is having major issues. But it has like the little green tea flex in it. Yeah, it does. Right. Okay. It looks like green tea. Ready? It tastes just like green tea. Mm-hmm. I wonder if this has caffeine. With sweetener. Mm-hmm. Well, it's very sweet. If it has green tea, it probably has some caffeine, but probably a minute amount. Yeah. What else? I is also in feel it? like there's like a, almost a fruity. Mm-hmm. Do you get that? Mm-hmm. The only thing that's in it though, sugar, corn syrup. Mm, of course. Green tea powder, green tea extract, mm. and green tea flavoring. Oh. And that's it. And this whole bag was only $1.99. That's actually kind of good, mm -hmm. if you like green tea. Yeah. Okay, mm. the next thing we got was an assortment of baked bean cakes. Um, I honestly don't know much about it. It's all obviously in Japanese, but it has a bunch of different cookies and stuff to try in here. Mm. So I thought it'd be like really interesting. And I've never really had red bean, have you? Um, I think oh, I've had I red bean in some sort of drink before. Oh yeah, oh yeah, you're you know right. What I mean? Like, I feel like red bean has kind of a. I don't know what. How would you describe it? I I can't even think how to yeah. describe it right now. I'm sorry. And it's really cute because they all yeah. come individually wrapped. It's hard to hold it up. I don't want it mm. all fall out. Um, mm. but they're like squishy. All these. Mm. So, do you wanna? 
That's more like a biscuit. Yeah, these are like biscuity. I don't know what should we try. Should we try like one of these and one of these? Sure. And like split it. Yeah. Okay. Definitely. That sounds okay. Good. So the first thing we're gonna try is this biscuity. You can't see it. I'm sorry. I'm just gonna hold it back here. Um, and it's very dense. Mm-hmm. Definitely. Should I break open sure. yours? <gasps> there's something. Oh, in there's a filling. Oh, it's red bean paste oh, in the middle. It's not chocolate. No. <laughs> chocolate would be. Oh, good. I'm nervous. Mmm. <laughs> oh no. Excuse me. Are you allergic? I don't know. <laughs> Excuse me. The filling has mm. almost like a powdery texture. Like a you bean. Get that? Like, like a bean. when you bite exactly. into a bean. Like mm -hmm. a bean, but it's very sweet. I thought when I looked at it, it looked like a fig newton almost, but it's mm. much better. It's actually really good. Mm -hmm. Next thing we're gonna try out the same package. I have no idea what's in it. It's a little bit smaller, and it's in an individual um, packaging again. Oh, it's a tiny little cookie. Oh, that's so cute. just tiny like this. It almost looks like what we just ate, just a smaller version. Mm -hmm. But it has something else in the middle. It has like a green filling and it smells very sweet, almost cinnamony. Hmm. Doesn't it? It almost yeah. smells like a donut. It does. Mmm. Wow. Yeah, the filling, um, is like the red bean paste, but I think they put more like cinnamon or flavoring or something in there. Yeah, it's just, right? it's just very sweet. Mm -hmm. This is another one in the pack that we're just gonna try um, individually wrapped again, just a different shape. It might still have the red bean paste in it, I yeah. don't know. We could be wasting our time with this. I know. It's good, so. A whole pack of. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah. Oh, it has white filling in it. See, so the fillings look, di it's different. It like, smells very sweet, again, like a bakery baked good. Yeah. Hmm. No. It's very plain. I don't, it's much I don't, more mild than the other two. Mm -hmm. And not as sweet mm -hmm. as the last one we had. The other one was just like super sweet. Mm -hmm. So the next thing we got, oh, you want? Oh, oh I'm sorry. <laughs> Get ready. <laughs> Sorry okay. about that. So the <laughs> next thing we got was, it's called pickled daikon, is yeah. that how you say it? Um, and it's actually homemade at the place that we get it from, but I'm gonna cover this because you guys don't know where I live. Mm -hmm. um, and it's basically a mixture of radishes and carrots and vinegar and sugar. Yeah. So I don't really think you can go wrong with that. And it's a, is it a Chinese or a Japanese daikon? Oh God, it smells radish. really strong. Oh really? Wow. It smells yeah. like seafood almost. Uh-uh. Which... Well, there's no seafood. I know. I know. Okay. Okay. It's very strong. After sweet, this is going to be a little... Yeah, I know. I'm a little weird. I know. Is it getting a good amount? <laughs> it smells like when there's red tide in the, at the Ugh. beach. <laughs> it does smell Doesn't a little it? weird. Why is that? I don't know. There's no seafood in okay. it. Okay. Okay. Mmm. Mmm. Wow. If you like pickle mm -hmm. things, this is very good. Mm -hmm. mm. It does have a weird after it taste. Like a it smells. Bit. But yeah. I really like pickled things, so mm. I think it's pretty good. And this isn't made, like meant to be like eaten alone. You put it on toppings, you can put it in what, like sushi? Yeah, anything. Salad. Yeah. Anything. Anything. So it'd be, I, that's probably why it's so strong, is because you don't eat it alone. Right, right? exactly. And the last thing we have to eat is uh, peanut mo mo mochi? How do you say I it? I think Mo-ch. that's... Yeah. Um, this actually isn't a frozen one. They have frozen ones with um, like ice cream in the middle, but we just got one of these. You can freeze these too, but... Um. Oh yeah, the woman was telling us mm -hmm. that um, she takes slices of this mm -hmm. and mixes it with vanilla ice cream. It sounds and she delish. Said, yeah, if you like peanut butter <clears throat> and vanilla, mm -hmm. definitely. Oh, that's cute. So, mm -hmm. this little packaging. The only one um, we've ever had before is frozen with ice cream in the middle, and I really mm -hmm. didn't like it because it was like almost powdery on the outside. Very powdery. Yeah, on the I, I'm hoping this one isn't this like that. This doesn't even look like. No, it looks the like outside. it has peanuts yeah. on the outside, which is good. Mm -hmm. So, and it comes in its own individual wrapping. It's mm. very um, squishy. <laughs> oh, it's like peanut butter oh. in the middle. There we go. It's very like squishy, gooey, like 
gelatinous almost. Yeah, it really is. Oh okay. God, I don't know. I don't know either. I, but it smells great. It just smells like Yeah, it like smells like peanut, peanut butter. butter. Yeah. Okay, ready? I thought it'd be a lot sweeter. Mm-hmm, me too. I'm not the biggest fan of like the jelly on the outside. Mm -hmm. It's a really weird, weird texture. I feel like I'm eating a slug. Like it's right. Isn't that what it is? Oh, is that what it is? I, oh gosh, I think. But it's not sweet. This is like mm -hmm. the opposite of those red bean things yeah. that we were trying. Mm -hmm. It's still a dessert, but mm -hmm. hmm. it's nothing like, it's still good. I mm -hmm. will eat the rest mm -hmm. of it, but okay. The last thing we have to try is a drink and it's ginseng. We still can't see it, but you get the idea. And there's the ginseng, it's a root, right? Mm -hmm. In there, um, isn't ginseng kind of strong? It is, yeah. it's supposed to be really good for you. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. So I'm a little nervous, so they said shake it up. Oh, is that what it said? Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, just to, I guess to get it all mixed up, honey. Is she crying at the door? No. Doesn't smell like much. It smells like tea. Ooh, it's got a weird, like almost mm. chemical -y smell. Oh God. Where is this made? <laughs> <laughs> In. What does it say? China. You're probably only supposed to drink a little bit you of this. So? I think this is like more of like. Okay. I don't know. I don't want to say medicinal, okay. but. Yeah, and it's, it has a yellowy color to it. Oh, God. It smells so I'm bad. Nervous. It smells really I'm bad. just going to take a little sip. Oh. Mom! Oh! <laughs> oh, God. Oh. Oh. It tastes like dirt. It tastes like soap. Dirt would taste better. <laughs> Oh, it, it just, it tastes like, I, I mean, it's not that, sweet. It's very sweet, which is weird. But it also has like a chemically taste. Yes, it does. Like, because it's soapy like, almost, like that very bittery aftertaste. Yeah. Ginseng is a root. Yeah. So, oh, this is actually really good for you. Yeah. It's believed to provide an energy boost, lower blood sugar, increase uh, cholesterol levels, reduce mm. stress, promote relaxation treat diabetes and treat sexual dysfunction in men. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, that doesn't help us. <laughs> um, so that's it, yeah. And that's it's a cool. big, like, Asian-Korean kind of thing. Yeah, so that's probably... And it boosts the immune system. Oh, wow. So maybe yeah. that's why they sell it in such exactly. a little bottle. You're only supposed to have probably yeah. a little bit. Unless they add it into, yeah. like, i Does it say it. Um, serving size? Oh, I don't know. That's a good question. One bottle. Wow. I don't know if I could drink all that. I know. Maybe it's a taste you get used to, but yeah. I mean, it's really good for you, so I'd suffer through it. Yeah. You know, if I had those issues. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so overall, these really weren't awful. No, right? they weren't. I'm surprised. I thought mm -hmm. we'd be like gagging, Me spitting too. stuff out. I mean, the tamarind mm -hmm. candy was probably the worst. The worst. Or well, the drink no, too. the drink. Yeah. Is, this is probably. Mm -hmm. Yeah. This is yeah. definitely. Yeah. Yeah. Unless but you overall, want health benefits, yeah, I, I don't I think would, I would be drinking. I wouldn't drink it with like. Mm -hmm. I'd rather drink water or juice. Mm -hmm. We had a really good selection of things. You really, you picked out some good yeah. stuff. Yeah. If you guys like this video, we can do a part two because they do have a lot of stuff there. Um, if there are other countries or continents or whatever mm -hmm. you want us to get things from, um, Publix does have an Oriental section. Yeah. With more stuff. Yeah. So we can see what's there or you know find stuff around but anyway thank you guys so so much for watching well thanks for having yeah. me again. please like and subscribe if you haven't and i will see you guys next time bye